Hey, howdy, hey, y'all. Leanna here. Happy Mask Monday. Today we're going to do some skin care. I'm going to put this chapstick on, kind of like Dion does, because my lips are feeling a little dry. This is Chaga. It's made from the Chaga mushroom. I absolutely love it. I can't put it back up on the shelf. Today I am going to be doing this Cream Shop Blueberry and Banana Fusion Sheet Mask. Two mask in one. Blueberry combats fine lines and wrinkles and the banana exfoliates to brighten the skin. It says to leave the mask on for 15 to 20 minutes. No rinsing necessary. Allow the skin to absorb all the nutrients and then while this is marinating, I'm going to show you my AM skincare routine. So let's get this put on. I was expecting this to smell like blueberries and bananas, but it doesn't. It, it smells like a summer beach. I don't know. I don't know what that means. Oof. It's very slimy. So this mask has the little flaps so that you can pull the mask up over your eyes. I think this might be the first one that I've had that actually has that. I'm getting it all in my hair. So you can pull these up. over your eyes like that very very juicy very slimy feeling <laughs> okay so we're going to let this marinate and while it's marinating I'm going to show you my AM skincare routine enjoy so here are all the items that I use every day in my morning skincare routine. And some of these products are products that I have received in boxes, like these two Elemis eye products. One is the Elemis Peptide 4 Eye Recovery Cream, and the other is the Superfood Matcha Eye Dew. And I love both of these products. They're really good. They're a little on the pricey side, but they work really well. And so I just put a little under each eye. I start off with the lighter of the two. And then I just rub that all around my eye. I know a lot of people like to do the patty thing. I do not. I just rub it in, make sure that I get it all around my eye, even above, because I will get little creases up here around my eyebrows. And I just rub that all in. And then I immediately go into the Peptide 4 and add a little bit of that. And again, I do the same thing. Pat it around and then just rub it in, making sure that I get it all around my eye. And I always rub outward because I notice that the skin in my inner eye feels like it's pulling in, so I like to rub it out. That also helps with that lymphatic drainage as well. And I've noticed a big difference in the wrinkles and the texture under my eyes since I've been using those two products. Next, I go in with my Timeless 20% Vitamin C with Furilic Acid and Vitamin E. I absolutely love this product. I have tried several. I don't know if you can see what that looks like. I have tried several different vitamin C's 
over the last year and a half. And this is absolutely my favorite. It works better than any of the rest. And I have tried some expensive vitamin C products. <clears throat> and I love this timeless vitamin C. And it is very, very affordable. You can find it on Amazon anywhere from 17 to 26 dollars just depending you know how they will change their prices and i will have all of these products linked down below so that you can find them the next item that i go in with is this timeless coenzyme q10 serum again this is another timeless product that i just absolutely love i put about seven drops and just rub that into my skin. If you notice when I put the vitamin C on, I did not put the vitamin C on my eyes. I do put this product on my eyes as well as all over my face, down my neck. I make sure that I rub it in really good and I know a lot of people pat, they'll pat. I do not. I also put it on the back of my hands. I like to massage my products into my skin. The next item that I use is the Ordinary Niacinamide. Again, another very affordable product and this I actually We'll just kind of put some on my skin. I don't like to put this one in my hand and rub it together because for whatever reason it will foam in my hand and I don't like that. See how it's kind of foaming a little bit? I don't know why it does that. I just am not real fond of that foaming thing. <laughs> Weird, I know. One of the weird things about me, and again, I like to massage that into my skin. The next product that I use is this Ordinary Argerlene Solution 10%. This is really good for your fine lines and wrinkles, and some people will just put this in those areas. I put a half a dropper full and just put it all over my face. I do like to concentrate it around my eye area though because that's where I have the most fine lines and wrinkles. And again down my neck and on the backs of my hands. And then I'm using this Earth Arbor Celestine. It's a Hydra Plumping Peptide Serum. I really like this. This came in one of my boxes and I'm not sure that whether I will repurchase or just use this up. I love the way this smells. It has kind of a lemony smell to it but it works really well. And then I go in with my Tony Moly Green Tea Watery. This is the Chock Chock Lotion and I put two pumps. You can see <laughs> that I'm almost out. I just repurchased a backup so that it will be here and be ready when I run out. And I put this all over. It feels so good. And I like it because for me, if I use creams or lotions that are really heavy, it causes the melia. You can see that I have some here and that they're starting to go away now that I'm using lighter products. And that works really well. My face right now is so so incredibly soft 
And then I go in with my CeraVe PM face, Facial Moisturizing Lotion. I do two pumps of that as well. And it is um, kind of on the thin side too. And yes, I know that this is an AM routine, but I use that. I don't use the CeraVe AM formula. I like the PM. Such a good product. It has ceramides in it, which are really good for your skin. And the last thing that I do is I put on this Agency Dark Spot formula. And I get just a little bit because I don't need a whole lot. And yes, the directions say to use it after you put on everything else. And then I just hit the few. I don't have a lot of dark spots. I just hit the few that I have. And to be honest, I have not really noticed that it's helping. I am absolutely loving the hi biscuit, hi biscuit, the agency tretinoin that I have been using. That's in my nighttime routine, but I really have not noticed a difference using this dark spot formula. I have been trying to use it on my chest. You can see that I have a lot of dark spots on my chest and actually they may be looking a little bit lighter so I'm going to continue using it. it I haven't been using it very long and just see how it does and so I have been continuously recording for 10 minutes it takes me 10 minutes to do my morning skincare routine and I absolutely love it I love doing my skin care. It really makes me feel like I'm taking good care of myself and I'm showing myself some self-love. If you do not have a morning skin care routine, I highly encourage you to start one. This is a very simple routine. I'll put down a, a, in the description a recommendation for a different eye cream. I have a Neutrogena that has a little bit of retinol in it and I love that too. I'm using these because they came in a box but the Neutrogena is very affordable and I will put that down in the description box too. All of these products are very affordable and you can start with just buying one. If you just bought the vitamin C and started with that and then you know every couple of weeks or once a month add a new product in before you know it, you have a whole skincare routine. Okay, so I've had this on for about 18 minutes. So obviously you're seeing this video kind of out of order because I will now be putting, actually putting on my skincare after the mask. But I wanted to let you know what I thought of the mask and the, the scent has dissipated and it said not to rinse it off. It feels a little tacky but it's not quite dry. So my skin feels nice and soft. It does seem to be a little bit brighter. I love the cream shop. They have really good masks. I hope you enjoyed watching my AM skincare routine. I am also going to be doing a PM skincare routine because I have kind of sort of figured things out and this is the routine that I am pretty much going to be sticking with for quite a while. So if you enjoyed my video, don't forget to show that like button some love. And as always, I'd like to remind you that makeup is meant to enhance the natural beauty that you already are and we are all beautiful at any age and any size. Find something to be grateful for today. Pull your makeup and your skincare out and play with it, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye-bye. Christopher, do you have a morning skincare routine? I think your morning skincare routine should be that you shave. Okay, Mama loves you, boo. <laughs>